double-double, 13 points and 12 rebounds. Oh, yeah, Fowry, just another 6'10 guy, and there's that kid. He knocks them down at 31%. There you get a look at O'Boyle, drives inside, nice pass. Yeah, they get another uh, get another look here as Tyrone Perry. Turnover. Here comes Jaworski, he'll get rid of it. Perry with a little floater, can't get it high enough over the rim. Outside, and Justin will wait for everybody to fly <laughs> by him and will not drop. Well, it was down, controlled by Aldama. Good sign early on that Justin knocked down the first one. He had a clean look that Good defense by Lafayette so far. Looking to make something happen is Jalen Andrews. That one put up and one another. It, it, they're very familiar with the with the style. So a lot of the backdoor blue wins. You have to finish first or second in the North, Central, and South divisions, and then the best records of the for almost all their shooters is unlimited. But uh, you you got to draw the limit at the sideline. Aldama and that will not go. And Tomas has been used sparingly. But when you play these back-to-back -back games, you pretty much use your whole bench. Trying to find Quinn. Instead, EJ will put it up. Doesn't go. Easy rebound for Aldama. Hey, Aldama. Aldama with three rebounds yeah. already. Loyola has. Way outside. This is Bradshear. And that doesn't. Neal's not a, a fouler necessarily. He's a pretty good defensive player. Bradshear with the basketball. He'll get a little screen there. And he'll kick it back outside. Aldama at 25 against American. And as we mentioned, normally a very good foul shooter. Hounded by Bradshear. And O'Boyle. O'Boyle's been too quiet of late, and he can't get that. That's put the ball in the basket. Here comes Bradshear. A little hesitation. Shake and play. Ooh, no walk, I get. But they love to work off the high post. Bowery nowhere to go. Finally gets rid of it. Went sour. Nice job by O'Boyle to go and get that rebound. EJ thought about it. Now he'll take it to the hole, and that won't go very often. And that's what this Greyhound basketball team does. Watch this go into the bucket. Boy, he's tough. And what that length does, too, it, it allows you to close out on the shooters without having to give up the drive. Jaworski kicks. Jenkins puts it up. Jen 11 uh, Aldama running at you. That's going to change your shot. Look at that. Lafayette is just nothing's uh, nothing's been easy for them. There's the inbounds, Pappy. Long, lanky Aldama. And and uh, how about the Bain is where he comes from. Career high 25, career high 12 rebounds. Losing streak. Trying to break that tonight. Aldama. No, don't let him go right. He's tough when he goes that way. You can really good with the dribble for a guy that size. He's good for a guy any size. <laughs> right. EJ Stevens and rattle the drive by Holcomb. And that's a pretty yeah. uh, safe play out of bounds. It. Talk, about high. A, talk about a safety valve. <laughs> He's throwing it as high as you can. There he is again. Look at that. Oh, that's Wanting Dorsky down the paint and kick. Hastings. Back cut, but not much in credit to the length and, and the defense of, of the Greyhounds. That could be an offensive foul. Oh, I thought so, too. He really pushed off. Well, that's easy. And where they seem to just keep running into roadblocks. They get it to Quinn. Quinn's going to go against Aldama and win. But uh, that is, isn't a bad guy to learn from when you're learning from Bob Hurley. Limiter. Lafayette's going some zone now. Watch out. Weak side. Good Lafayette in this game. He's had a big first half. A little confusion there defensively. Whoever was guarding Jenkins. Oh, there's DK. In. Get that one to go. Outside. Needing a three and not getting it as O'Boyle. And the ball is loose. It's a Jenkins up under. Game. So uh, don't go anywhere. The way Lafayette can score in bunches. Aldama gives it up. Lafayette staying in the man. Yeah, they switched back in a hurry. Aldama again it is now it does to go up on the board. Second personal on Jaworski. Probably as much a frustration. And uh, the shot clock is still on. Only a fraction of a second. Basketball as uh, again the. You see the wind, clock winding down. There's the guy who they want to have the ball. Aldama, no. Aldama. Ball. The zone defense has not been as effective oh for my. Loyola. What did they let the, open the for Justin? He's wide open if he gets it back, but there's the long exactly. arms of Aldama who kept that pass from getting to a wide open Neil Quinn. The ball was going to. Right. 
Quinn's going to back DK inside, put it up. Oh, got hit on the arm, no call. DK, Aldama inside. Well, you're not going to. Justin's on the perimeter. Jenkins, nice dish. Jenkins gets to get it going. You can't force it, though. Let the game come to you. Inside, Aldama, Aldama up and in. The side of the rim on. I mean, just so long. Great bounce pass inside. Quinn back up. Jones. That one wide open shot doesn't fall. Great rebound, Aldama. Around the bucket, he's unstoppable. They want to get the ball to him right now, and they will. He'll get double team. Yeah, Drop pass. it off there. And it's a two-point ball game. Pull-up jumper by Andrews. And came in this ball game, averaging 17.2 a game. Number seven in the Patriot League. Yeah, EJ is explosive, but he has been held in check. The triple by Tyrone. Or Fowry lost it. Drive wide open. Verbinskis does not. You can shoot the ball the way Lafayette can. You always have a puncher's chance. Inside Fowray, he gets. So uh, Tavares Hardy going back to his starters. Has made up a 10 point halftime deficit. Ball's off the foot. And right now it's Loyola that's out. Him, but boy, I tell you, he's got such a high ceiling. What a good player he's going to be. Oh, nice play. The height on the basket because uh, it looked like he was playing on a. Oh boy, oh, waits for everybody to go by. And there is a nice soft shot that doesn't fall for Neil. He decided to put it up himself when he found no one open. Here comes EJ. He'll drop it off. And here comes Aldama with the step back. He's looking to put it up. Now he <laughs> a little flip pass. Why not? And they'll start all over again. Again, no return so far for Tyrone Perry. There was the play, and it, that's the second, 61-58. Neil Quinn is so good at finishing around the rim with either hand. Aldama all the way. No, again, coming to Easton, PA, to take on the Lafayette Leopards. We'll have that game for you. Drive. Jodorowsky smart enough not to foul. He got over there and in this year. But he's got 26 now. EJ, first field goal maybe? No, doesn't go. Verbinska shakes it loose, and then Hastings the line. Eight rebounds. He's looking for another double-double. We mentioned at the top of the show. Such long arms, but, they, they, you know, sometimes guys with long arms, difficult. The deficit to two. Go, Tyrone back in. Tyrone can't get it to fall. So it's good to see. The face of Neil Quinn. Put up, not dropped, then the rebound, a good one by Jank in the first half. He misses the second. As shaking that ball loose was foul, Ray, and now a chance to tie the ball game up, maybe take the lead, and it does not go. And Absolutely. Neil Quinn, such a soft touch for a big guy. Quinn with six rebounds to lead the oh. But he looked like did Aldama on that play. Well, he's got extra legs, extra arms, extra elbow. Oh. That Lafayette has in trouble. There goes EJ. Stevens down. He, and they want to get it in. Jaworski. Well, we're, Jaworski will be somewhere in this mix. Here he comes. And 